Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumours that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? I'm not convinced you need to worry. Perhaps your uncle's been delayed, and surely he can take care of himself. That's exactly what Professor Weasley said when she forbade me from leaving the grounds to look for him. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Ugh. Could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Could this be Mr. Oaks' campsite? Ranrock's loyalists, just ahead. Should I take them by force or be disloyal? Yeah, another human. If, if you're there, why is it grapple you? Incendium. Explode. Let me Now to find out what happened here. Revelio. Adelaide said that her uncle kept notes of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. we have here? Hmm. I may have more luck higher up in the keep. Revelio! about me. Promised. 
down there. on Ramrock's hand. Incendio! Rebellion! One way or another, we'll get what we wrote. No! Akio! Incendio. Revelio. This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free. My wand and wait you're a student oh we must get you to safety immediately it's dangerous it's all right mr oaks i've dealt with these goblins before dear merlin you're either very lucky or very talented well, how did you find me i'm a friend of adelaide's she was worried about your business with ranrock's loyalists oh she was right to be i couldn't go through with the agreement and when i told them i ended up blindfolded and behind bars locked in that infernal cell for so long they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasting goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Mr. Rokes was lucky. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. <laughs> 